So guys, just want to say a massive thank you for tuning into this uh, this part of Guardians of the Galaxy. Uh, I really hope you enjoy it. Uh, if you do, please just uh, leave a comment. Just let me know what you think. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. I uh, hope you enjoy. We should set course for Contraxia. They bear our issues over a cold catastrophe. I don't hate it, but... Chapter 6. We should report what we saw first, right? Because that's our biggest problem, Quill. Come on, Groot, we got Scott to do. Rocket! What's with him? The abomination is never happy. <laughs> Rocket's got a point, though. Our cons are flarked, the tracker's still counting down, and Corel could be anywhere in the universe. <sighs> it's not looking good. We are in the place between hard rocks. You mean a rock and a hard place? That is what I said. <laughs> Hella knows we could use a night off. So, Contraxia? We should go to nowhere instead. Ah, another suitable location to partake in liberal libations. To report what we saw. Me and Cosmo go way back. He's chief of security. He'll make sure the right people know about the rock. And the tracker and fine? Rocket's got a guy in nowhere. We kill two birds with one stone. Okay. I'll set the coordinates. Maybe talk to Rocket. Cosmos the dog, right? Oh, <laughs> didn't realize I have to get up. I was locked in the cutscene. Peter Quill. What does killing two birds with one stone signify? Hey, Drax. You alright? You must be feeling pretty crap about having to punch through all those coughs back on the station. Uh, do not worry. I simply need some time to get my thoughts in order. Right. Never thought we'd have to fight Novacor. The soldiers we encountered were not acting like Novacor officers. And those robed priests, it was all... Very disturbing. Gotcha. Good talk, Drax. Alright, where's Rocket? Quill where's my really cares about this team. He wouldn't get turned around as soon as the next girlfriend walks into the room. Hey uh guys. What's up? Nothing at all, Quill. Not a thing. Uh something wrong with Groot? Nope. He's just, uh, defoliating. Seasonal thing. Come on, I know you're lying. You guys are planning something. What we do ain't none of your business. Leave us alone, Quill. Try again. Uh, Rocket? Flark off, Quill! Oh, good talk. Alright, let's go find Gamora. So those coordinates. They're in your console. Got it. Where are you going? Do you want to talk? Assassin. Calm down. I'm just going to the bathroom. I am not agitated. You just looked at me like you wanted to stab me. My apologies. I have been told I have an angry thinking face. Did Rocket say that? No, it was Hovat, my late wife. Oh. Sorry. She used to compliment my contemplative scowls. She found them very arousing. All right, I'm out of here. All right, you got. Do you want to talk? Talk to your crew. Oh, what are you doing? Assassin. <laughs> what are you doing? The events unfolding aboard the rock qualify as a <laughs> mutiny, correct? Look pretty this? obvious. To oh, yeah. 
Even if the officers who rebelled were under the influence of a mysterious force. Oh, there's songs really on it. That they rejected Nova Corps orders and started killing their shiftmates. I Damn. find it repulsive. All right, let's go. Nowhere here we come. and home to the best black market deals you can find. And surprisingly good noodles. You ever wonder what kind of person found it was like, oh look, the severed head of a giant celestial being. Let's drill holes in it and live inside. They wanted the brain tissue. Very rare, very valuable. The marketplace came after, along with noodles. You were certain this Cosmo is trustworthy, Peter Quill? Of course. He's chief of security. And nowhere. And as such, probably deals with Nova Corps all the time. Trust me. He's gonna want to know about the rock. What are they doing back there? Shenanigans, likely. See you never, Flarkbags! Oh. A rocket and Groot, did they really leave? Yes. It looks like it. Do we know where they went? You're the last one who talked to them. Yeah, Rocket seemed pissed off. <laughs> Try to behave while we're gone, okay? <laughs> Maybe when we get back, I'll ask Groot to give you a bath. Guess you were right. Turns out we couldn't trust those guys. I still have faith that the tree will bring the rodent to reason. At least you're still here. I wouldn't want to miss your meeting with Cosmo. Right, let's go speak to the dog. Fine, whatever. We'll talk to Cosmo and then we'll go out and have a good time. Like I said, we go way back. Plus, he's probably already heard about what's happening. All we do is confirm the rumor. Maybe he'll even give us a reward. I can't wait to see the rim. How do we uh, reach Cosmo Security's house? Downtime. What is it you are so eager to do? Drink, gamble. What about Rocket and Groot? What about them? They left. What am I supposed to do? Chase them down and beg Ooh. them to come back? You could apologize. That's your advice? The apology does not need to be sincere. I guess if we ever see him again. Big if, by the way. But if it happens, then maybe I might think about it. Anyway, once we let Cosmo know what's happening out there, we'll have more time to think about what to do with Rocket. If Rocket doesn't come back, we'll need a contingency plan for getting rid of the Nova Tracker. Why? We have not yet spent our ill-gotten gains. We could still pay the fine. But we'd have to go all the way to New Xandar to do it. What if we get there and it's compromised too? There's got to be someone shady enough in the market who can help. Maybe. But Cosmo deals with Nova Corps all the time. Maybe we can pay the fine through him. Didn't think I'd miss nowhere this much. The attachment we feel to certain places and people. What on earth you got there, mate? That's surprisingly profound, Drax. Who are you waiting for? <laughs> what the heck is that? Mate, you look like the arcane of uh, Mass Effect. How do we find this cosmos? 
We head to his tower on the far side of the market. That's where he keeps an eye on things. Uh, I'm just having a scout about. I don't want to miss anything. Hey there. I need to talk to Cosmo. He in his tower? Should be. You know the way? Straight through the market. Oh, wait. You're telling me directions? Something else I can help you with? Yeah, uh, tell me no, them directions again. Good. Enjoy your time on nowhere. Roger. Be good to see Cosmo again. I guess I kind of miss the old boy. How exactly do you know him? Was he also a prisoner of the Chitauri? Nope, we met right here, back when I was in the Ravagers. Dishonorable killers and thieves. The Ravagers actually did some good during the war. Even look the ahead, magist of Max will behave. Look ahead. Whatever bad stuff we all did is behind us. We're the good guys now. Right, heroes for hire. Except no one will hire us. Maybe Cosmo will have a fetch quest for us or something. We might even come out ahead on this. Keep an eye on your things. These troops are a bit hands-on, if you know what I mean. They have fortune tellers on Earth, Peter Quill. Some people who claim to be able to see the future, sure. Do you mind? You're making oh, really? me uncomfortable. Your planetary shots are very unaligned. I want to see if anyone's got anything to say. I don't actually know what all this scanning is about. Soothsayers on Katath were unable to predict its demise. No one could predict what Thanos would do. Mad Titan will pay for everything. Just scan everything. He's gone, Drax. His death helped end the war. You were his adopted daughter. You believe that? I didn't. Not for long. Who's that? Nexus, what are you? Do you still have those suicidal urges? What? No? What's madness? When you thought joining a team would be bad for you. Hi. Sunlord, right? Sunlord, yeah. That's it. It's Starlord. Hey, that's right. I forget which version of you I've met. Did you do the thing yet? <laughs> what is the thing she is referring to? No idea. Hi. I don't know if we've met yet. I'm... No, 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 it's not. Oh, oh, no, he's lying. I mean, oh. Where the Kotatis he wrote, the broken promise of all will be mended. What? Thanks. <laughs> Don't worry. It's always weird the first time. Celestial Madonna. Ah. Uh, Hi, guys. You should not be in this place. Actually, I'm exactly where I need to be. I think. No. Yes, this is where I need to be, or needed to be. Am needed. Yes. Wait. Why are you here? You cannot keep leaving the sanctuary. It's not safe. There are rumblings in the galaxy. <laughs> when aren't there rumblings in the galaxy? <laughs> yeah. Okay. We're gonna keep making that face. <laughs> it was nice seeing you again, Gamora. Star guy. Okay. Bye. So, Gamora, you and Mantis seem close. We've met. Okay. You're being evasive, woman. Wait, woman? Uh, That's the nicest teaser. thing you've ever called me. Anyone ever tell you you're an open book? Hardcover or paperback? I just meant Mantis mentioned a few things. Mantis says a lot of things. They don't always make sense. Until they do. That insect woman was odd. I understand your reluctance to discuss her. 
Mantis is strange, but she means well. I think she does, anyway. Uh, door over there. I'm not gonna stop to say everyone. I'm not even sure if everyone's got something decent to say. Last time I saw her, we were sharing a prison cell, except... <clears throat> I need to leave. Uh, what? Something wrong? It's not your business, Peter Quill. Do not wait for me. Who's that? Drax! Watch it, Star Lord! Watch yourself, jerky red guy! Oh, he knew his name. Can you believe that? Then there was one. I should go talk to Cosmo alone. All right, reach Cosmo security tower. All right, should we have a stout about? Let's see if there's anything in there. Like I got something stuck in my throat. Galactic you want units. To it down. Not from you, mate. You're... No, thanks. Was hoping for a friendly ear, though. Never was one for small talk. Especially if you ain't a paying customer. Mate, you're like the scariest bartender I've ever seen in my life. Holy. I'm there. Has anyone actually got anything interesting to say? No. You want to know a secret? Go on, huh? I'm just an illusion. A sect. I'm not really here. I couldn't tell. You look Wait. real enough to me. Are you supposed to be like uh, an alien Mysterio? <laughs> there we go. I have no idea what direction I'm going in. What's all this anyway? Ooh, a one armed bandit. Hard to say, but it looks like it's almost ready to pay out. 500 classic units. Go on in, it's black. Okay, one game. No lemons, no lemons. Oops. Yes! Oh, purple! That's a jackpot! Woo! Uh, what? Why are you paying out? Little error. Please contact local. Ah, oh, crap! You gotta be fucking kidding me. What? Uh, still broken. Lousy game. Right, can I, yeah, I can't sprint. The game's dunk soup. All you gotta do is pitch the right cup to win. Are you looking for something in particular? Not really, mate. What the earth is that? One of those games where I have no chance of winning, is it? Captain, Captain, Captain. Don't you know your onions, Captain? The good Bolshevik cleaned up the boardwalk. No grip, no crap, no cheats, no cons, no sir. So I can win. How about this, Captain? We play a friendly low stakes game just to prove that I'm on the up and up. What do you say, Captain? What do you say? Uh, go for Fine. it. I'm in, but don't try anything funny. Not me, Captain, not me. I run my game straight as an arrow. See? The ball's in this cup. Now, keep your eyes glued as it moves. All right, all right. Uh, the middle one. Uh, the middle one. Hey. Well, I'll be. You got it, Captain. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Congratulations. You got a sharp pair of peepers. Here's your winnings. 
See? My game's on the level and plumb true. A game of chance means you always have a chance to win. Yes, you're right. Sharp as a tack, Captain. How about we play again? Maybe raise the stakes just a smidgen? Nah. Uh, I better not. I'm good. Not feeling very lucky right now. My team, my friends, they... Sorry to hear that, Captain. Can't really help you there, but I can offer you a bit of destruction. Alright. Alright, that should be a little bit better. Alright, so... We're going... In... I don't know What's what direction. Wrong, you look terrible. This yeah. is a place to forget your trouble. Smell. What's that? Dark Matter Jacks, cards, Rubier is the biggest cash out in nowhere. Okay. I wonder uh, where everyone's actually gone. Don't run over here. What are you guys doing? Hmm. The only thing that can heal pain is time. I don't know I'm going that way anyway. Alright, what are these guys garden? I hope Cosmo's in the office. Bridge closed. Go away. Doesn't look closed. Sisu. Nowhere security. Super official. Go other way. Ali. Ali. I really need to see Cosmo. Cosmo not in tower. He out there, Star Lord in Ali. Wait, how did you know my name? Go, or end up in Cosmo prison. You choose. Oh, that's no choice. Gotcha. Well, this doesn't look suspicious at all, does it? Good. Not weird at all. Cosmo is definitely somewhere in this maze of rotting brain matter. Is that what it is? Wow. Okay. Just gotta find Cosmo. Then I can deal with the team. If I can find them. Imitate Drax. Are you yeah. afraid, Peter Quill? I'm a brute and near invincible. I fear nothing. You, however, <laughs> will perish in this maze. Um. Left or right? I guess we go right. Who's there? Hmm. Oh, I hate mazes, especially stinking brain mazes. I'll go okay, through that. Dude, right. Deep breath. Deep breath. Wait, does this just lead back to our game? Oh, hang on, we can go through here, can't we? Can we? 
There we go. Ah, uh, so just done a circle. Got you. Cosmo. Whoa. That you? Imitate group. <laughs> Let's Look go, Rocket. Look at you, Flark and Hume. Bet you end up inside one of them processing machines. <laughs> Flark! I'm give myself a heart attack. Be here. I don't understand. 